Here we see a representation of the behavior of particles in a solid. Please note that the particles are close together and they are found in regular repeating patterns. The particles themselves are not moving in relationship to each other. In real solids, there is actually a small amount of movement for the particles, but that movement is really vibrational. Again, one particle is not moving in relationship in relation to the other particles in the solid. Now, if I set these particles in motion, what we would be doing here is adding heat energy to a solid material. As the particles are freed to move around, now what we're looking at is particles still packed closely together, but because they're free to move, they're now demonstrating the behavior of a liquid. Now we see the Java applet being used to illustrate the behavior of particles in a gas. Please note that the particles are moving much more quickly and they are also spread out a lot more. We see that there are a number of collisions taking place not only between the particles but also the particles are colliding with the inside walls of the container that is holding them.